Liberance, sorry, Liberance. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This is the energy for the month of June. The month of June is a sun energy, it's a fire energy, it's the energy of the sun with the zodiac energy of the hair and um, the energy of water. Okay, so the two, two first weeks is going to be an air energy, and the two last week is going to be water. In this month, I want to say thank you to each and every one of my subscribers. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the positive response. Thank you for the wonderful um, positive messages that are coming in. And please remember to listen to your sun, moon, and rising side. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. And I hope you will stay. Please like, share, and thumbs up these videos. And let's see what is happening for you. Um, a liberance. We have the energy of the wheel of fortune. This is wonderful. So a lot of you are going to be very uh, getting a lot of lucky breaks. And for some of you, um, uh, for for everyone, this wheel of fortune is going to be affecting. It's a yes month. It's a month. Go for it. You have the sun and the wheel of fortune. This is two yes. So if you're thinking about making a decision, a choice. Um, to make some changes in your life go for it because you have the wheel of fortune and the energy of the Sun so let's see what is happening for the first week for you liberals we have the energy of the king of swords and I know just to see the person with the swords coming up at you <laughs> so um, the first week a lot of people over the age of 40 um, uh, over the age of 45 is going to be affected with the energy in the first week and the second week we have the energy of the king of the um, someone over the age of 45 and this is the energy of and Pisces cancer or a scorpion okay so you two are going to be some in some pickle uh, you two are going to be in really uh, some pickles something is going to be happening because and this is a karmic situation this is a situation that is coming from lifetime and lifetime before okay so um, be aware of this situation and what is happening what is transpiring be aware of this situation for um, the energies and situation that is happening okay as we move forward we're looking at the energy vibration of the third week so whatever is the situation in the third week let's take a look at this in the third week we have the energy of the four of one so in the third week um, you have a strong foundation okay um, the fourth week is going to show you a strong foundation whatever is transpiring whatever is taking trans transaction in this week it is going to be the energy of a strong foundation that is happening for you guys so this is going to be good so another fire energy so let's look what is happening in the fourth week in the fourth week you have the energy of the seven of ones you're trying to protect yourself um, it's as if you are really 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 trying to protect yourself from a lot of situation that is happening and transpiring around you um, it is as if there are certain situation that is uh, um, people and, 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 and the lower energy and the frequency of lower energy people are coming at you and you're having this fire energy to deal with you so let's go back and recap um, your weeks you have the energy of four weeks and in the first week you have um, especially this is going to affect the people over the ages of 45 and older um, 40 45 and older this first week is going to be affecting so let's see what is transpire what is this karmatic situation between you and this king of cups it has to do with someone a woman for some of you is a woman because we have the princess of wands for some of you is a woman is a woman and this is an um, Aries and Leo or Sagittarius so you men are dealing with a karmatic situation that has to do with a woman or a child it can be for some people a child but it can be for some people a woman that is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and this is the situation that is transpiring and affecting both of you men because this situation is coming from lifetime and lifetime before that this person 
um, either she's your daughter or this situation has to do with maybe she was um, your wife or girlfriend or uh, something in a past life and now she comes back as um, a daughter or someone who you're working with or you're having contact with of that sort of thing this woman could also be the person who is making um, who's affecting um, uh, who's making um, troubles for um, and bringing up these this confusion but it is a karmic situation as we look at um, the energy in the second week going in the third week we have the energy of someone who's a Pisces cancer or a scorpion and the situation of a house or the four of one and there you have an energy of the queen of swords okay and, and, and this is going to affect the people the ladies the feminine energy 25 and older this is going to affect you and it has something to do with some of you or um, uh, have a situation to do with at work with someone who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion or some of you are dealing with a situation with someone who is in your house who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion this person is over the, the age of 40 and here you have this situation coming in what I'm also seeing here is that if you are um, between the ages of um, 18 or younger and 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 uh, to 40 you have a situation that you're dealing with a sister a sibling rival in the house uh, there is a huge sibling rival in the house this could be also a relative that is living with you or you could be sharing a house with someone but there is a rival you could be cousins who are living together but there is this huge rival that is uh, going on um, between the first week and the third week let's look at the third week going into the fourth week we have a situation that has to do with the eight of ones okay we have a situation that has to do with the eight of ones the energy of the eight of ones is that a lot of information will be coming at you whatever the situation is and playing out a lot of information will be coming to you now this information some of it is people calling you unnecessary callers who are calling you unnecessary people with lower energies that are lying and, uh, and harassing people because there's a lot of harass, harassing call and I can never understand the ed space and I don't really want to understand the ed space of someone who calls someone else just to harass them you know you're seriously hell you know um I, I you know that is just something that I'm thinking oh my god that I'm going to call somebody to arrest them I know I can call someone if I'm upset with a person and like person hung up on me I'm gonna call you back and I'm going to let you have it but not calling someone just to arrest them the, the head space of some people are really off so you have to understand that too okay so let's look at what is really really happening um, in the second week because the second week a whole lot of people are going to be having an effect that you're dealing with someone who is a Pisces cancer on or a scorpion this could be for some of you as a father figure or a mother figure but there is a situation between two ladies and um, it doesn't have to be it can be masculine and feminine but here I'm seeing a sister rivalry or two women um, who are seen um, someone who is a Pisces cancer or scorpion but this this man is over the age of 45 and these ladies between the ages of 18 and 40 um, is seeing this man and there is a rivalry because some of you are really having this rivalry so what is going to be the outcomes the outcomes is going to be the eye princess it's as if um, some of you are going to be um, finding out that there is someone else um, some of you are going to be finding out that there is someone else there's another person in this relationship some of you are going to be finding out that there is someone who is an Aquarius a Gemini an Aquarius a Gemini or um, a, a Libran who is in this relationship and it's as if the your intuition is going to be telling you that there is someone else in a relationship there is someone else in a relationship that you are dealing with so um, this situation that is happening is that your intuition is going to uh, it's as if some of you 
realize that you know your partner is acting a little bit strange that sort of a thing and then you're going to be realized for a lot of people it is a rivalry it's as if you or for some of you women you are married or for some of you people over the age of 45 or 40 that you are with this um, Pisces cancer or scorpion man and you know your intuition is letting you know that he's seen someone much younger and that is going to be happening in the second week the energy that is here for um, the third week with the four of ones it has to do with a situation at home some of you ladies between the ages of 25 and 45 is going to decide to leave wherever you're living is as if um, some of you are going to be going off to college so you have to be looking for new places but some of you are going to be leaving a relationships some of you could be leaving a work situation some of you could be deciding to move somewhere else because you're not happy where you are and you have the eight of cups so it's a leaving behind okay so I started I, I was I was channeling and then I had the energy in my hand that is leaving so you know this is a lot of you um, between the age of 25 and 45 especially the ladies are going to decide to leave um, either your house behind a situation because you have twice the eight of cups so number eight um, twice you have the eight of ones and you have the eight of cups so a lot of you are going to be deciding to leave somewhere leave a situation um, leave something behind you and moving forward to something that is much better because especially in work a lot of you are going to be deciding to leave um, where you're working or leave that career behind you and move forward and do something that is much better and this thing um, because whatever is happening is as if your intuition is guiding you to the um, make a decision to leave a relationship with some of you behind um, some of you are going to have uh, your intuition or your spirit guides are going to come in the form of the eye princess secrets are going to be coming out because here is the energy of the eye princess secrets are going to be coming out over someone um, your partner could be seeing someone else secrets are going to be coming out um, um, with this and and some of you are going to be having a situation where you have the energy of the eight of cups and the eight of cups is a situation where you're leaving the situation behind you guys have 88 the infinity the um, situation of abundance so a lot of you are going to be the universe is going to be a blessing a lot of you because you have the wheel of fortune and twice eight in your reading so this is um, extremely wonderful because I'm seeing for the readings that I have done so far is that I'm just seeing people 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 a lot of people um, but in your readings um, here is the energy of the eight so a, a lot of information will be coming um, to you about work a lot of information um, some of it is going to be good uh, some of it is going to be you know just don't harass me um, that sort of a thing and and some of it is going to there is going to be a new start that is coming out for a lot of you people especially in the second and third week of the third and um, fourth week there is going to be a lot of situation that is going to be coming out so if you have been looking for work like in the third and fourth week a lot of information about new opportunities are going to be coming out for work but as we look at a situation that is transpiring because this this month of June is for the people between the ages of 25 and 45 this month of June is between for the people between the ages of 25 and 45 and what you're going to see is that there is a lot of secrets that is going to be coming out you're going to be aware of certain things you're going to be aware that your um, partner or um, whether a woman or a man is seeing someone else this is this is this is happening and from some other people there's a lot of work some people are going to decide to leave um, a, you know your relationship behind leave a house behind and uh, um, some of you are going to decide um, to leave um, in your work situation and change your career totally and then this is going to be much better for you the outcomes of your month is the energy of the nine of swords and this energy of the nine of swords is the thought you're going to be thinking how is how um, is as if you're going to be planning how best how best 
to do this how best to do this you're going to be planning how best to do this how how can I move forward um, and, and, and make these new um, situation but a lot of secrets are going to be coming out a lot of secrets are going to be coming out because here you have seen and it is um, secrets that you're going to be um, finding out that your partners um, are really really um, in other relationships so a lot of secrets are going to be coming out so you need to be aware of this okay it's as if your spirit guide is going to be um, um, letting you uh, bring in information to you okay so for the men over the age of 40 you're going to be having a situation with either your um, if you have um, a relationship with someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're going to have um, some secrets is going to be coming out about this person some secret is going to be coming out about this person okay let's see um, what is the secret is this going to be coming out there's going to be a solution okay so you men you men over the age of 40 um, that has to deal with either your daughter or someone you're in a relationship with who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius there is a solution that is going to be coming to the situation there is a solution that is going to be coming to the situation okay as we look at um, the energy of work people change in career and that sort of a thing and you're thinking about leaving your career behind and you're there in your the, the head and the thoughts and you're having all these thoughts of how you're going to be doing it because the nine of swords it's not it's just thoughts going through your head and if you're deciding to leave a career behind or go and and start something new you need to think about this because you're thinking about leaving behind what is going to be the outcomes the outcomes is going to be good because the outcomes is going to help you to have a wonderful new beautiful start so go for it because what they're saying is that this is what you were meant to be whatever you're thinking of because um, for you guys this month is a yes yes month you have the general energy of the month is the Sun and the wheel of fortune of the month is the Sun and they're saying yes yes go for it because it's going to be um, whatever that you were looking for whatever that was happening for you um, this is what you're looking for and this is what is going to be transparent so this is going to be actually actually very very positive okay so let's move on and we are going to be um, looking at the energy so not to worry um, ladies and gentlemen there's new love coming in um, some people are going to be connecting with their um, the soulmate twin flame and soulmate also okay because you see that energy coming in and um, for the people who are deciding to change your career yes go ahead and do it because it's um, this is something that you're going to really really love okay so we're looking forward and we are going to look at the energies for um, uh, work um, money and career work money and career we are going to be starting with um, I'm not sure what is happening but the energy of justice just flew out so um, yeah if you have legal situation you're going to be winning this legal situation this is also your energy vibration so if you people have a legal situation you're going to be winning this legal situation big time let's look at the men over 45 what is happening for the men over 45 in work in the month of June you are leaving your work so you are the people who are leaving your work behind and looking for a new positive career and this is going to be good for you let's look at your financial situation for the Librans who are over the age of the men the Libran men over the age of five and fear took in the month of June what is going to be your financial situation um, if there was a legal situation with money and that sort of a thing you're going to win big time um, this is a new start in your financial world is let's say that you were having a little financial situation and that sort of a thing here you are going to ha be having this huge 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 new beginning that is going to be coming for you there is going to be a new start with your financial situation so this is good for the men over 40 let's see what is happening for love for the men 45 and older what is the liberal men 45 and older what is going to be happening for the liberal men 45 and older um, you are going to have a situation where, um, some of you are going to be um, do, getting a divorce or some of you 
are going to be thinking of getting married or some of you are going to be thinking of uh, um, to go um, to decide to um, sell your house or invite someone to come in and uh, share your life and this is going to be good so um, this is um, extremely wonderful whatever is happening it's going to be um, very positive because in love especially when the air fan comes up that means um, it's always like divorce it's always divorce you're waiting on a court case uh, and, and, and for some people it is that you're about to um, decide to um, ask somebody, someone to marry you and decide to ha go in a committing relationship which is good and for some people it's as if um, whatever the situation is that is happening that there is going to be new changes that is coming up so let's move on and look at the latest over five of year to year the liberance lady 45 and older what it is for you with your work in this month of June 2018 the world so you ladies 45 years and older you have the energy of the world coming up for you this means that you are going to find your your ending um, um, one job and moving in a new job some of you are going to decide to end your job and move into a new job and this is going to be much much better for you okay you're you're leaving a career behind or you're some of you are going to be leaving a career behind some of you are going to be um, leaving um, your a work um, a company behind and you're going to be starting a new company and this is going to be better for you let's see what is happening for you guys in um, your money sector so some of you are planning and thinking how can I make more money so some of you ladies are going to be planning and thinking how can I make more money how can I um, make my business flow that sort of a thing and it's going to be um, extremely good because you're going to be looking at ways the means of uh, um, increasing your financial um, abundance and this is going to be happening for you guys so let's look, look at love for the um, liberal ladies 45 years and older to see what is happening uh, love for the liberal you are going to be meeting the the, the um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man so in love for some of you liberal ladies you're going to be um, connecting with um, a Taurus a Virgo or a Capricorn man so let's see how that will go because um, in business it's good but in love now I don't know ladies I don't know so let's see how that is going to be working out for you okay we're moving forward to the people 25 years or 18 till 40 um, no um, for the people 25 years um, to 45 for the people 25 years to 45 what for you liberals what is going to happen in a work what is going to be happening in a work you are going to be um, looking for work you're going to be looking at new ways of um, of making money um, you're going to be looking for work or you're going to be start to think how can I do something um, to make more money for myself and this is going to be good so um, it's good when you are thinking about starting for yourself or using your own hobby um, to become a career um, let's look and see what is going to be happening in your money section so deliverance 25 years to 45 years what is going to be happening in your money section in the month of June 2018 we have the energy of the two of pentacles so you're going to be trying to balance out your financial you, you you're good trying to weigh out how you're going to balance how to pay the bills and that sort of a thing and it's going to be okay because um at least whenever you start to make a change whenever you start to make changes in your life whenever you start to look at ways how you can um, help yourself out then the universe always open a door for you so let's see what is level for um, the Librans, um, 25 years between 25 years and 45 years. What is in love for you in the month of June? You're dealing with um, <laughs> the Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, and here he is the Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. He is in the, your general reading that 
he's going to be, you're going to be dealing with him in the second week he's here he's here in the general reading that you are going to be dealing with him in the second week so um, yeah the second week for um, some of you people who were born um, uh, who are between the ages of 25 and 45 this is where um, the energy of the Pisces is going to come up in the second week emotional week because he's he's here in the second week in the general readings so let's go forward and let's see um, what is going to be happening for you um, people 15 years old till 25 15 years till 25 15 till 25 what is going to be happening with school work and study for you guys 15 till 25 Ooh, this is a wonderful energy the ten of cups the ten of cups is going to be a happy family life because you guys are on vacation you're loving it you're with your family you're seeing your parents work um, this is going to be good because um, you're connecting with your family some of you could be um, working um, with your family for summer some of you could be just connecting with your family for the summer and this is going to be good some of you could be doing um, um, you know visiting families for the summer and that is going to be good let's see what is happening in your financial sector for people 18 and oh some of you will be connecting some of you will be receiving a message of money this could be people who are applying for student loan and that sort of a thing you could be receiving a message um, and this message could be coming from someone who's a Pisces cancer or scorpion um, about um, you know hanging out or doing something or you know let's go here we share the bill that sort of a thing um, that is going to be good let's see what is coming out for love for the, um, the, the the people 15 years between the age of 15 and 25 for the liberals what is happening here for love Ooh, a lot of messages mm -mm -mm. you have a lot of admirers out there a lot of admirers are going to be coming in a lot of you are going to become uh, coupling up with a lot of admirers that are coming in and this is just going to be wonderful because what is going to be happening is that a lot of you are going to have choices different different people who you can choose from and this is going to be good it's summer enjoy it is summer enjoy my darlings it is summer and joy okay so let's look and see we are moving on to the zodiac um, the zodiac um, part of the reading so let's see for the people this is first for the people who were born from 12 a.m. till 7 p.m. what is going to be happening for you guys okay you have the energy of the Pisces come the Pisces yeah you have the energy of the Pisces coming in which this is going to be happening in the second week the energy of the Pisces is here in the second week some of you could be coupling up with the Pisces um, in the second week because there is a lot of and whatever solution whatever situation is there it's going to be resolve so a lot of you are going to be coupling up with the Pisces especially the people who were born in the day that mean if you were born um, 12 a.m. snacks until 6 p.m. Um, 12 a.m. <laughs> until 6 p.m. a lot of you okay and then we are dealing with the Leo's so some of you will be dealing with the Leo's so um, that could be in the first and second week that you're dealing with the Leo's um, this is a situation that's in the first and second week that you're dealing with the Leos whatever the situation is some of you will be um, dealing with the Leos so um, be aware of this and it's uh, mostly um, some of you women um, you know will be um, dealing with the Leos okay um, let's go forward and look at the people who were born after 6 p.m. in the evening after 6 p.m. in the evening you have Jupiter this is wonderful having Jupiter is wonderful Jupiter with the wheel of fortune this is a lot of luck coming in Jupiter with the wheel of fortune is a lot of luck that is coming in so for a lot of you Jupiter will the wheel of fortune you 
guys are going to be very very lucky a lot of luck is coming in and this is positive so let's see what else is coming out for the Libras for the moon star and Librans you have the energy of your own um, energy vibration and this is good so a lot of you guys are going to be balancing out certain situation in your life which is just going to be so wonderful and so positive and so good because there is going to be really a trans transformation that is coming in which this transformation is going to be very very positive so I am really really loving this for you guys this is just really really a wonderful positive energy that is um, transpiring here and it's going to be um, a very 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 positive whatever is happening so here we are here we were seeing um, situation that is happening for a lot of you and this is going to be good so let's think about it and let's see um, what is happening what is transpiring what is happening what is transpiring and let's see what is happening here peace peace is going to be the outcomes of your month peace is going to be the outcomes of your month um, the energy of the lily is always peace it's always a transition it's always um, wonderful energies that is coming out so I'm seeing a lot of resolution and the energy of peace coming in here and this is going to be good because whatever that was transparent especially um, um, for men over the age and older and that sort of a thing whatever the situation whatever that was transparent you are going to be seeing peace coming out if you with situation with career can indicate long-term establishment long-term career for some of you and um, some people could be starting their own business and uh, this energy comes out often indicate affairs so era was in the general reading saying about some of you are going to find out a secret um, with an affair affair with a man and, um, and this is going to be happening so most of the um, the information that came out you're seeing it coming back in the energy of um, um, in the energy of the reading you're seeing this coming back in the energy of the reading so I am wishing you guys um, wonderful uh, solutions to whatever situation that is going to transpire in your life I want to say namaste until next time